$100,000 in the hand or $150 a week for 20 years? Okay, any suggestions? Well, let's have a look. So, which is, so what we want to do is we want to look at what is the present value of the cash, for, for cash stream. So at face value, so we just say, okay, and this sometimes they, the raffles offer you this sort of thing. So we've got $150 per week times 52 weeks per year times 20 years comes to $156,000. Okay, so if you look just at that, and a, a naive observer would do so, and they'd say, oh, this is much better. I get 156000 compared with 100000 It's 56% better than just getting the lump sum. And it, it is um, attractive. Plus, is the old money now is much more fun than money in the future, so 100000 is better. But in the other way, you think, well, if I got 100000 now, I'd just waste it, whereas if I got $150 a week, that would be pretty cool to have it coming in every week, and so on. So there's other aspects that come into it as well. Now, what we want to do is have a look, and what happens if we use 5% discounting? So what I did is I made this ridiculous spreadsheet, which starts here, and so there's our month. We get $100,000, and we earn $100, and we get $0.67 cents interest, and then we get $200, and we get 100 and so on. So, oh, I've got the wrong one here, sorry, let's get the right place. Okay, this is the one here, $150, and we're getting the present value of it. Okay, get this right now. Okay, so you get that, and it's saying that the present value of $150 in one week is $149.71. So if I have $149.71 put into the bank account for a week, by the end of the week it's $150, because it's in 29 cents interest. And then if you go through, and you've got all of these heaps and heaps, all the way down to 10,040, those are all of the weeks that we get $150. By the end of it, the present value of that last cash flow is only $20. So $20 now is the same as $150 in 20 years' time. Okay, so using that particular chart there, we can find out the different rates. So say at a discount rate of um, 5%, Okay, we get a net present value of 98,583. Yeah, it works. Okay, discount rate of 10%. We get a net present value of 67,000. Now, that actually, that 10% is more realistic as to what's happening at the moment. I mean, basically, most mortgage rates are around 10%. So, what looks like a much better offer is, in fact, only 67,000, which is considerably less than 100,000. Okay, so that's pretty much what we're talking here.